this is Emil Menashe for Acoustic Guitar Magazine, and here I have the FERC Blue MM Dreadnought. Now, blue, clearly this is not a blue guitar, but blue is the way the model is designated. FERC uses the colors of the rainbow or the colors of the spectrum to set their model price points, and blue is toward the bottom of the middle in terms of their hierarchy, but this is far from a bottom of the middle guitar. It's an extremely nicely made and very, very playable instrument. MM stands for mahogany, mahogany, and more mahogany, which is really nice for me because I happen to like the sweetness of mahogany guitars. It's a solid African mahogany top, back, and sides. The neck is also mahogany and it's treated with an antibacterial coating. The fingerboard is ebony, the bridge is ebony, the headstock overlay is ebony, the inlays are minimal white dots, and the binding, which is probably hard to see on camera, but is a faux tortoiseshell that looks nice. The guitar has what Ferk calls an open pour finish, which is a very light finish that's designed to allow the wood to resonate. Another factor that lets this guitar resonate, according to Ferk, is the way the neck joins the body and the technology used to create the neck reinforcement. It's a combination of light alloys and carbon fiber and a neck to body joint that minimizes the amount of territory that joint takes up and allows the top to resonate. It has a very even tone across the dynamic range and also is very consistent from low to high. The model that we had comes with an optional LR Bags Stage Pro Element pickup system that has a three band EQ, volume control, notch filter, and built in tuner. You're going to hear a combination of the pickup and a microphone in the room and some ambient sounds. So you might hear my dog snoring or an airplane overhead. Anyway, without further ado, here we go. Menashe for Acoustic Guitar Magazine.